Tresaka helps me to my room, and Saber is waiting for me by the veranda corridor. Even, even if you failed not all 30 times, you fucking moron. I don't even have the strength to answer. It's just, uh, I just nod and, and thank Hanks and head into my room. It's a typical merciless uh, Star Saka response. And the next thing I know, I'm staring up at the night sky. Tonight, I'm not uh, trying to run away because as I'm anxious around Saber. I'm just trying to let the night wind cool my burning body and to think about what Tosaka taught me. Once I can use my switch, then it'll uh, be time um, to think about uh, the next steps. If I can't imagine a simple, uh, if I can't manage a simple, uh, the simple task of strengthening, I don't know what uh, the future might hold for me. I try to infuse magical energy into a wooden plank I dragged out uh, from the shed as I uh, mumble to myself. A cracking sound and echoes up to me. The plank cracks and my strengthening fails. I can see its structure fine, but I don't understand why I can't control my magical energy. Tokos Tosaka said I was putting too much power into it. She even said that I should use uh, small amounts of magical energy and just focus on reinforcing uh, the object's weak points. So she's basically telling me to take it easy. She doesn't have to remind me. Problem is, I can't manage to ease up. If only there was uh, a good way to relax. The sound of barely audible footsteps just reaches my ears. This is the second time I've sensed that presence. What? I don't need anything from you. I throw the plank away, glaring at Archer. Archer seems curious about uh, the plank. He picks it up. What? Yeah, I, I know I'm not uh, a fully trained mage. I feel bad for making uh, uh, your master take uh, connect, uh, and take on extra work for me. Eh, what do you mean? He's just saying whatever he wants, but I can't, uh, but I can't think of a response. He's right. I know I'm not skilled, and it's not my, uh, and it's my own fault that I can't do magecraft properly. There's no point in taking it out on him. Shut up! I'm just not uh, saying anything because you're right. It's all my fault I'm not uh, uh, being good enough. I huff and look away. I don't know how uh, we interpreted that, but... Archer almost sounds impressed for a moment. Eh? That's not true. My old man and Tosaka are good teachers. I'm the one who can't learn. だからだ。お前相手にはな。何も分かっていない魔術師の方がうまく作用する。天才には凡人の悩みは分からない。リンは優等生すぎるから、落ちこぼれである。お前の間違いに気がつかないのだ。I don't really get what Archer is trying to say. I don't get it, but uh, if I had to guess... I don't get it. Are you trying to pick a fight? If so, bring it on. それも間違いだ。エミヤシロは格闘には向かない。お前の戦いは精神の戦い。己との戦いであるべきだからだ。They say a mage's battle is a mental one. I already know that. But if we're gonna fight, it should uh, be with our fists. 
Okay, Bird. Uh, welcome, uh, welcome to the stream. How's your day? Uh, I'm good, and uh, my day's been good. Archer despises me from the bottom of his heart. I've never seen in, in his eyes like this. They seem filled with uh, real disappointment and anger. <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. Saber already told me that. I won't win in battle. No matter what grand scheme I try, I have to, uh, uh, I have no chance of victory. Don't think of the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. Don't think of the Stay Puft uh, Marshmallow Man. Fuck. <laughs> I don't know why, but Archer's words strike a chord in me, with me. My heart's telling me not to forget them. More than uh, anyone else, I should uh, never forget what this man's saying. <laughs> All of a sudden, Archer disappears. Um, Archer's supposed uh, to be keeping watch. He must, uh, he must have gone back uh, to the roof where he can uh, do that best. What's with him? I complain uh, to the empty air. Naturally, there's no response. While Archer's words echo in my mind, the cold air blow, uh, uh, blows over my flush, uh, my flushed body. Eighth of February. Uh, Neo. I'm dreaming. It must be because my blood is feverish and my entire body is throbbing. Something I'd rather not have to remember plays out in my dream. This is my oldest memory. It's also a memory I can't escape. It's a scene from 10 years ago, and one I usually try not to think back on, and I can't uh, ever uh, erase it from my memory, though. I can't, uh, I can't ever erase it from my memory, though. It's not that I forgot. It's not even uh, that I want to forget. It's just that it's already happened. So it's not especially painful. And I don't really feel all that angry about it, either. The past is the past. I can't return to it. I can't redo it. All that happened is, is that I escaped and, and, and lived on. Looking forward is, uh, is all I can do. Nobody told, me, uh, uh, nobody told me to do that. But I've got, uh, uh, but I thought uh, about that ever, uh, even and if, uh, if just vague, if, even if just vaguely since I was a kid. I can't forget or deny the past. The only way to keep uh, the memory of, uh, of what we lost alive is to acknowledge it. It's hot. I wake up to find my body still burning up. I must have wound up falling asleep uh, out in the cool air last night. Inside this dimly lit sh uh, shed with me and... Hi! Saber? You should sleep on a fucking bed, you fucking moron! 
Oh, morning. Well, I was burning up last night, so I went outside and got sleepy. Uh, sorry. I'll try, uh, I'll try to, uh, sleep in my arm room next time. Rin's with, with her. They keep shouting for food. Fujini, what she want? Eh? What? It's already past seven? Crap, I overslept. Saber uh, provide uh, it's a calm analysis of the situation, but I don't have time for idle chit chat. I know you went out of your way to wake me up, but uh, but going back ahead of me, I'll hurry up up and get changed, then head to the kitchen. Saber turns and heads back to the house. Calm Fujini? Saber sure has adapted well uh, to our morning routine. I dash to the kitchen. I ignore Fujini's jeers and prepare breakfast as quickly as I can. Sorry to keep you waiting. There's not much time before school starts, so hurry up and eat. I plop breakfast on the table. Suddenly... <laughs> Fujini explore, explode, uh, explores, explodes, practically spitting fire. Hey, I overslept. I don't have to make. Uh, I don't have time to make anything else. And breakfast with toast is uh, typically just that. And it's just missing thing, salad and an eggs. So there is not a huge difference. And plus, you can run. Uh, you can uh, run with it in your mouth. Fujini tries to appeal uh, to Saber and Toosaka, who both eat in silence. This isn't going to go in her favor. Neither of them, them are as gluttonous uh, as Fujini. She's barking up the wrong tree. Hey, wait a minute. I thought she didn't eat breakfast to begin with. <laughs> now why is she sighing all disappointed? Uh, that's it's way out of character. That's so unfair. Besides, it's, uh, if I start making a dish now, you're going to be late, Fujini. It's already 7.30, so you need uh, to do the whole running hang out of the house with a piece of toast hanging from your mouth thing. Give it up! <laughs> he actually referenced what I was joking about. Okay. <laughs> That's nuts! What, what, what kind of teacher even are you? Just eat your toast and then go to school. I absolutely refuse to make anything else, even if it kills me. <laughs> you don't need to remind me. Thanks to you, I'm practically an old man already. I haven't taken a bite of toast. Okay, she might be right. 
There's something kind of sad about uh, there being so many uh, people here and the only and only having toast for breakfast. Well, I used to have only toast for breakfast for a long while. The sound of clashing Shinai echo through the dojo. Each bout goes essentially the same as they did as they had days before. Saber uh, casually sweeps my desperate attacks aside and counterattacks far, far more effectively. I barely manage to uh, block and continually uh, strike back, only for Saber to repost, and I lose every time. <sighs> 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 I stop, breathing, uh, breathing heavily, shoulders heaving. Wiping sweat from my brow, I work, uh, I work to get my breath under control. Uh, hold on, I need to catch my breath. Uh, a little, uh, a little break, please. Saber stares down at, at her poor student. My body just won't listen, no matter how uh, she looks at me. And would you please uh, get rid of that uh, fucking hot rod? You fucking idiot! Why do you keep thrusting it in your fucking back? I know that, I really do. I just can't do almost anything today. My situation has drastically has drastically changed since yesterday. Well, before I do that, can you do uh, uh, can you do something about that first? I point them in towards our audience standing by the hall. Tosaka doesn't get it. I can't concentrate on fighting Saber with her staring at me like that. I just gotta blind you! Whoa, hold on, Saber. I haven't caught my breath. Saber suddenly vanishes. <laughs> the moment I realize I'm in danger and raise uh, the she and I to guard my uh, uh, face, Saber strikes me right on the head. It was a rough morning. After getting knocked out, I stopped, uh, wor uh, I stopped worrying about uh, Tosaka watching. My focus went entirely to blocking Saber's attacks, and next thing I knew, it was lunchtime. I'm not sure if it's because uh, she enjoyed seeing me getting uh, knocked around, but Tosaka is in a good mood. The two are resting in the living room. As for me, I'm preparing lunch by myself as, as punishment for my uh, lax approach to training this morning. Unbelievable. I want to just make uh, something uh, easy, like uh, cold sonin noodles. Sonin noodles. そうですね。そう意識したことはありませんが、剣を握っている時は感情を止めているのかもしれません。それは試合といえども変わりはないのでしょう。
それって女の身で剣を持つための心構えってやつ体格で劣っているから心だけは負けないようにって。And pure physique, right? それは違います、リン。冷静であるのは戦う時の心構えですが、それは男も女も変わりのないことでしょう。リンとて戦闘時には女王を捨てるはずです。あなたはそれができる人ですから言ってくれるじゃないまあそりゃあ事実だけどさけどセイバーのは私とは違うわよ絶対私は捨ててるのは甘さだけだものあなたほど達観はできないわそのようですねだからあなたは華やかなのでしょう戦いの中でも女性のしなやかさを保っていられる何よ嫌味華やかさで言ったらあなたにはかなわないわ四郎があっちにいるから白状するけどね私初めてあなたを見た瞬間にすっごい美人だなって見とれたんだから。Wrong emo. Uh, I can hear you, Tosaka. So, I didn't know what you guys saw. この身が華やかに見えたのならそれは私ではなくセイバーというクラスが華やかなだけではないでしょうかそんなんじゃないってば純粋にね同じ女として負けたって思ったんだものそうでもなければあそこまでショックは受けなかったわよですからそれが間違いです私は一度も自身を女性だと思ったことはないし一度も女性として扱われたことはありませんその私が華やかであるはずがないセイバーズ words bring the conversation to an end As I listen in in kitchen knife in hand I find myself getting irritated by what セイバーズ saying I've always wondered what does she think she is I chop the chicken in a bit harder than I need to For some reason I'm annoyed 私は自分を女性だと思ったことはありません。Not that it has anything to do with me. I slam my knife down on the cutting board as if it were a hammer. It doesn't help me feel any better. 今日の課題はそれね。昨日より数は増やしたし。そっちの体も落ち着いてるみたいだから、今度こそ成功するでしょう。And you're taking dinner again today if you, if you fail all of them again. Yep. The Fate series is pretty gay. And it started right here in the beginning. I have no idea what she,、uh, uh, how she carried them here, but Tosaka reveals about 40 lamps. Tosaka leaves her room. Hmm. Alright. It's only been a night, but I hope I can succeed at least a couple of times. I broke them all! Phew, I think I got half done. I took an hour to work on strengthening about 20 lamps. Half of them shattered, and nothing at all happened to the other half. Of those that didn't change, maybe five look like they've been infused with magical energy. Now for the remaining 20. Hold on, wouldn't five be, be enough for a test? All the lamps look, look to the antiques. I feel ba、uh, bad about breaking more of them. Hmm. Yeah.
Okay, let us take a look at the chart. Wait quietly or go get uh, to Osaka. It's not an it's not an important and um, it's not an important dialogue option. We get we just get different uh, results. Let's go call her. I should call Tosaka back. I shouldn't break any more lamps. Actually, I really shouldn't be uh, taking uh, talking bed egg after breaking over 40 lamps. <laughs> hey, Tosaka. I call out to her, but there's no answer. That's weird. Did she step out of the house? Where else uh, might Tosaka go? There's someone in the shed. It sounds like Tosaka and Saber are talking inside. Hey Tosaka! The instant I left a hand to call out to her, a chill runs up my spine. I think it's because I feel Tosaka's magical energy seeping from the shed. It's pulsing with enmity. What the? I immediately stop calling for her. Even from um, here, I can tell Tosaka is agitated, but I can hear the two of them talking. Before I know it, that I'm eavesdropping. Taka, Tosaka sounds both angry and nervous. Saber stands silently behind her. He managed to fucking break everything in the shed, too! そう。なら教えてあげる。あいつは魔術師なんかじゃないわ。リン。それはどういう意味でしょうか。言葉通りの意味よ。魔術っていうのはね。So, you know, Full Metal Alchemist uh, rules. Gotcha. I never saw a Full Metal, you know, metal Alchemist. Kedo,これは違う。あいつはどこにもないものをここに持ってきてしまっている。ここにはあってはならないものを形にしている。それは。I have no idea what Tosaka is saying, but I definitely shouldn't be listening in and on the two of them. I walk away from the shed. I'll be lying uh, to Tosaka, uh, but I should go back to her room and pretend I was waiting for her to come back. It's two o'clock. There's no sign of Tosaka returning, so I just focus on finishing my assignment. Oh, the phone's ringing. The ringing just reaches my ears uh, from um, elsewhere in the house. It's in the living room. Tosaka can't... No, she won't dare pick up a phone and in someone else's house. I doubt that it's an important phone call, but I shouldn't ignore it. I stand up and head to the living room to answer the phone. There's nobody in the living room. Saber and Tosaka must be in the courtyard. Hello, Amir residence. Oh, 
Oh God, it's you! All of a sudden, Shinji's voice, uh, Shinji's voice sounds from the other end of the line, heavy with barely restrained laughter. Is that you, Shinji? What do you want? I don't think we have anything to talk about. I'm called to tell you how much better I am than you. Tell me something? Shinji sounds kind of odd. He seems weirdly excited. I can hear other students in the background, so he must be uh, still be at school. It's a little past two. Fifth period uh, should be over, so I think it's break time uh, right now. Not right now, she just stepped away. I don't know how to respond to that. Shinji's acting weird and we're, we're already talking. I don't see any reason to go all the way to school and if I take off without telling Tosaka, it'll feel like a betrayal. Sorry, but I can't go to school. If you have something for me, it'll have to wait until next week. I'll go back to school after the weekend. Shinji's yelling now. He must be really excited because uh, I can hear his heavy breathing over the phone. His tone shifts entirely and he even starts laughing. Hold on a minute, Come down. calm down. You're acting real strange, Shinji. I don't know what's uh, happened, but... Shinji seems to be enjoying himself. I've known him for about five years now, but I've never seen him um, so wound. Uh, I've never seen him so wound up. Shinji, are you? Well, even Fujini would get mad if I, uh, if I were late for her class, and I might uh, get even uh, more of an earful uh, if I only showed up for six period rather than just missing the whole day. Yeah, so to catch Jaybird uh, up, this piece of shit abuses his own sister. So ending a friendship with him isn't going to be a, much of a loss. In fact, I'll probably gain something. Our conversation ends here. In fact, I still hate the fact that she's his servant. All I heard is the buzzing electronic tone from the receiver. What's with him? But what should I do? 
Herzog should be in the house, but I don't see her anywhere. And if I go uh, to school, I can't bring Saber. But then, if I, uh, if I don't do what Shinji asks, I'm worried what he might do. He's probably agitated because of that merciless rejection Tosaka gave him yesterday. If I ignore him, he might get uh, violent with uh, Sakura again. Well, it's still bright out, so I shouldn't. Uh, so it shouldn't be an issue. I should hurry uh, now. Uh, I should hurry now and and have uh, uh, now that I made a decision. If I hurry, I should be able uh, to make it to, uh, by sixth period. There's nobody at the school gate. From the outside, it looks like the school uh, is deserted since, cla uh, since class is in session. Maybe there is no physical uh, ed uh, education class uh, either, since there's nobody in the, uh, in the courtyard either. That's weirdly worded. There should be only one either there. Well, that's not going to change in a f well, that's going to change in a few minutes. When six period uh, over, school's out. The campus uh, and uh, uh, the campus uh, uh, and exits will be overflowing with people on their way out. I head up to the third floor. There's nobody in the hallway either. Everyone must be in their classroom, so I feel a little awkward uh, walking into class C. Well, it's not like I'm going uh, to be completely conspicuous, so I should hurry to the classroom. Class C is down the hall. Right now I'm in front of class H, which is the closest to the stairs. So, uh, so there's five, cl five classrooms between me and my destination. Eh? A wave of dizziness slams into me. My entire body is also overcome with nausea. <clears throat> My stomach churns. My senses are going completely haywire. Red floods my vision, as if blood were seeping into my eyes. <clears throat> The temperature around me hasn't changed. My body is suddenly unbearably hot. What the hell is this? I stumble. Strength leaves my body. I feel like I'm withering and can't do anything to stop it. In the same way you can't and, and stop sand from falling in, in an hourglass. <clears throat> I'm suffocating. My throat burns. Was all the air sucked from the hallway? From the entire school? I sway and by accident stagger uh, toward a window. Desperate for air, I jerk it open. What? I freeze. This is so unbelievable. I uh, uh, I haven't even uh, I can't even find uh, the uh, and the wherewithal uh, to get confused. Outside the window, the entire the, the entire camp uh, is a, uh, is a field of endless red. It looks like uh, the school is, uh, is carved out of, of, of the world and plunged into a sea of red. The school building looks like an altar uh, draped in a red canopy. And then finally, I realized what's happening. <clears throat> I move away from the window. I must throw up uh, what sense I have uh, left and force uh, my feet to move, heading into the classroom closest to me. Inside, not a single student and is seated in any of the chairs. They're all lying on the floor. Even the teacher is on the floor behind the podium. They're still breathing. Everyone is convulsing as if pleading for help. Nobody is dead yet. The students don't have the strength to get up. They're just waiting to rot away. Seeing their miserable state on the floor, brings to mind the burning ruins from that day. Ah, mm. The nausea intensifies, but I can't get uh, to handle the situation. I take a look at uh, the students on the floor. It's difficult, but we, uh, but we can breathe. 
they're not dead. If I hurry and get help, uh, there may be a chance to save them. But the moment I check uh, the uh, fate uh, of a student nearby, something clicked uh, inside my head. Their skin. It's hard as wax. Not everyone is like this. It varies from person to person, but most severely weakened. Uh, the, but the most severely weakened and student's blood seems to be coagulated around their joints, oily and glistening. Stiff, motionless arms, thick, uh, uh, thick, uh, staring eyes, is just like uh, uh, just like wax figures. I know this. I recognize the scene. Stop. This is just a hellscape. I know this site well. I said stop. Ah, oh, we got the trauma coming in. It's all sustain. It's all. Uh, all that's sustaining me now is anger that uh, that has completely eclipsed my th any fear. <sighs> My left arm tingles. The command spell on my on the back of my hand is warning is warning me that the enemy is nearby. <sighs> oh. I run through my uh, breathe. Uh, though my uh, excuse me, so my breathing is labored. I've long since lost my mind. Oh, the voice I wanted to hear the least. At the end of the hallway, Shinji Mato is standing in front of Class C. My arm throbs. My command spells are screaming at uh, at me, tell, uh, telling me the boy uh, just, uh, uh, just uh, as the head caused all this. Isn't that just the most punchable face you've ever seen? So this is your doing, Shinji? Oh, duh. I can't breathe properly, and I glare at Shinji, who is keeping his distance. He must really like what he's seeing, because the next thing I know, Shinji throws his arms wide and starts cackling in, in the blood-red hallway. I hate you so much. So you were lying about having something to discuss. Yep, he's willing to kill an entire fucking school because he's jealous. Shinji laughs like it's the funniest thing ever. That, I guess I've learned never to trust them. <laughs> well, who the fuck would trust you? You're the most untrustable person on the fucking planet. Shinji's merry, laugh, uh, merry laughter bores into my skull like a drill. I have to point out, I'm plenty surprised. I just uh, been bracing myself to learn uh, who set up uh, the bounded field, Shinji or the other master. That was all. But so much for uh, my optimism. I should have settled things with Shinji the moment I learned he was a master. This is my fault. Shinji, why did you do th why did you do this? Were you lying about not ha having no intention of fighting too? Yeah. 
交渉材料だったんだよ爆弾を仕掛けておけば遠さからっておいそれと僕を襲わなくなるし万が一の切り札にもなるからね I see, but Tarsak has said it would take a few more days to activate the bound of field. Does that mean she miscalculated? Stop it. The nausea is, is long since gone. The one thing, uh, that one uh, uh, thing is all I can think uh, to say uh, to Shinji right now. Shinji, I said stop it. Do you have any idea what uh, you've done? Hey, what about Fujini? I bet that <laughs> I bet that pissed off all the Fujimura fans. <laughs> His neck is so close. I could snap it. I feel a switch flipping inside me. Tosaka said about pressing a switch in my head, but it's nothing like that. There's this echoing clang in my head. A firing hammer strikes inside my head, and the inside of my body suddenly switches over. This is your last warning. Stop the bounded field, Shinji. <laughs> Got it. Then it's really simple. All I have to do, I need to stop him uh, so I can stop the bound of field. Something surges inside me. Fiery heat blomp, uh, bloom uh, through my whole body. There's no more than 20 meters uh, between me and Shinji. It should only take an instant. My body is surging with vitality, so much more than when I may uh, uh, activate my mage craft, uh, my magic circuits. <laughs> A shadow wavers. The dark, uh, uh, the dark shape waiting in the corner of the hallway uh, begins to take shape and move. A hard, sharp ed, uh, edge made you know, of darkness itself. It's like a guillotine, ready uh, to uh, cleave anything uh, that approaches Shinji in two. I don't know what kind of magecraft it is. Three shadows emerge. If that, uh, that's all there is, I... 